was it three times more cattle on the farm? Correct. Yep. And you're feeding in about the same amount of time? Yeah. Yep, the same amount of time. And it's pretty nice, like the afternoon feeding. I'm typically not even here. Yesterday I was out fishing while I was feeding. And, you know, I come back at night and then I'll double check everything and do the pen and I'll check the pens, but it's very nice. It's really nice. In, uh, you're not here at four in the morning, right? No, that's a nice thing. The yeah. cattle are all fed. I get out here at like six or six thirty in the morning, and everything's fed. In the morning, so, is there much left in the bunk at that time? Or? Uh, yeah, because they feed at, it feeds from four to six, so it's just wrapping up feeding. Got it. So, that's been a hard thing with twice a day feeding. Is when I do my bunk checking. I used to always walk bunks at night, and now feeds at four. I'm just juggling that a little bit. So you got to check them at noon or something? I haven't been. I've just been checking them at like eight o'clock at night and that seems, it's just kind of learning how, what to look for, how much feed to expect. Are they ever clean? Yeah. Okay. I, they're actually empty for like two to three hours before the feeding. And then they can kind of ruminate. Yeah, those big game guys say that they want, can have, they want those bunks empty for six to eight hours a day on a once a day and two to three on a, or three to four on a twice a day feed. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, so it's mixing now? No, it's gonna start dumping now. Okay. Are you going to drive all the tractors? Oh,